Mm, 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 mm. Yeah, it's so remarkable. Big Blazer. Yeah, I say it over and over again. It's so remarkable. Check it out. Uh, here's some updated bars. Hit the dealership and told them upgrade my car. Upgrade my life, my biggest upgrade by far was the upgrade I made to feed my daughters tomorrow. Worked real hard, so I gotta celebrate. Pats on the back, few salutes and handshakes. Everybody calls and some text congratulates. Now my life ain't just good, but my whole life is great. I won't even lie, shed a tear when I got the news. Here's the story of a dude who refused to lose. Kept getting kicked to the ground and kept pushing through. Then dedicated his time to make it all improve. Equinox music is more than just the vehicle. It's more about me setting the goal and really see it through. It's more about the ball. It's more about my rise. It's more about me seeing my dream get realized. Uh, I make Equinox music. Yeah. But feel free to add the car you drive to it. Uh. I make Equinox music. Yeah. But feel free to add the car you drive to it. Uh. These are different kind of rhymes. Equinox music, I felt it was the time to put my thoughts down when lyricism's in decline and give y'all something more to help you stimulate your mind. Yeah, this is all about success, all about relief, this is all about no stress. This here is about starting over, starting fresh. This here is what happens when you work hard, do your best. Not about the car, y'all, the car is in the addition. The car is just a trophy since I made some good decisions. I can't lose my focus, gotta stay right on the mission. Gotta thank God since he kept my head in it. This is real life, these are real life raps. Overcame the odds, got myself about the trap. Failure's not an option, yo, my daddy taught me that. Equinox music, my victory lap. Yeah, I make Equinox music. Yeah. But feel free to add the car you drive to it. Uh. I make Equinox music. Yeah. But feel free to add the car you drive to it. Uh. Just the other day a homie said a couple things Said he looked up to me, wants the wife and wedding ring like I have Said he wants to have a big family Not because he's like my brother, but that meant a lot to me Told the young fella, I appreciate it dude Can't take my life for granted, should appreciate it too I'm just trying to do better, cause I know that if I do My success will be success not just for me, but for you yeah, I met my leadership goals, which instantly led to new leadership roles. Been exposed to the way that leadership goes. Now when someone looks up to me, my leadership shows. More than just a vehicle, it's more than just a car. This is real life, these are real life bars. More like an example of success from working hard. More like an example for my daughters tomorrow. Yeah, I make Equinox music. Yeah. But feel free to add the car you drive to it. Uh, I make Equinox music. Yeah. But feel free to add the car you drive to it. Uh. What's up, y'all? It's Big Rock TV. I'm back with another video. Alright, so step out a little bit, sit down a little bit. Early 2017, uh, I got in a car accident. I was here, um, you might have heard me speak about that before. I did a video on it, actually explaining the details of it. But I was in a car accident, and my vehicle at the time got totaled, right? Just completely, I got T-boned in the side, vehicle totaled car's history right and that was my my favorite vehicle i really found a vehicle that i actually liked and that i was looking forward to keeping for a while because in my younger days i would keep a car maybe a year two years three years and get rid of it i'm buying something new you know what i mean but i finally got in one of those vehicles and I, I loved it, man. It had everything I needed in it as far as things on the inside, um, you know, Bluetooth for my music, 
rear camera when I'm backing up, all the features that you that I needed at the time. Enough legroom, I'm 6'3", enough legroom for me up here, almost too much legroom. I have a daughter that's 10 that's about 5'2". Plenty of legroom in the back for her, and then I have two other daughters, so nobody was really crammed in on top of each other. And, you know, it just got totaled. But here recently, there was someone uh, that was selling the same vehicle, same color, just a few years older than the, the one that I had. And that's the Chevy Equinox. The one that I had was the 2013 Chevy Equinox. And uh, this one that I'm in, I bought it. I bought it off of them. Uh, had, had, has a good amount of miles on it. It's a 2010. has a pr pretty good amount of miles on it, but nothing crazy. Nothing that made me say, no, nah, I don't need that vehicle. So we bought it, and that's what I'm sitting in now. If you all saw, you know, the montage at the, at the beginning, you'll see that that's what I'm sitting in now. Um, I'm just... I'm just happy to have it back, man. Back in the back in the bow tie here, man. Uh, so that's what that's what I wanted to talk about today, man. Uh, what is your favorite vehicle? Now, for me, that would be this my favorite vehicle. Something that's to me that is achievable that I can just go and get it right now, and that would be a Chevy Equinox. Now, I had planned on getting back to the States and buying a 2000 and whatever year I get back, 2019, 2020, whatever year I get back to the States, uh, that was going to be the year I was going to get model But this one, this 2010 should hold me down for a little bit. Um, so I don't have to do that. I don't have to get a new car. But what vehicle? Um, outside of this, and something that's probably a little bit out of my price range right now will probably be the Tesla Model S. I really like that vehicle. I've done a lot of research on it. It just seems like a very dope vehicle, man. But it just it costs a lot of money. It costs a lot of money, man. So it's really not. It's really not something that I could just run out and get. And I don't even see them. You know. Not something that I could just run out to you know, the local store or a local dealership and cop Even when I was in the States, I didn't see one free on I would like to have a Tesla Model S if I had that kind of funding to cop one. Um, but outside of that, I also like there was an Audi, I don't know which one it was, but Kevin Durant had it. I went to the mall in Oklahoma City. And I didn't even know at the time. I was parked right next to Kevin Durant. And we went in. I went in the store. We went into the mall. And I'm looking. I'm like, man, this is a nice Audi. This is a pretty nice Audi. I can't remember what it was. It wasn't an A6 because I have a, a 2004 A6 behind this Equinox. But it was, a, it was an A9. It was a longer one. It was a bigger one. And when we were coming out of the store, uh... We're getting in. We're getting in um, the Equinox that we had at the time, and everybody's rushing up to that Audi, trying to, you know, take pictures. And I'm like, "What's going on?" It's Kevin Durant. And he's getting in this car, and I was like, "If six foot eleven Kevin Durant can fit in that car, then six foot three me would be in it and be very comfortable, and it'd probably be a lot of space in the back seat for, you know." the family in, in the event that I was going to use it for that. So I like that vehicle. I'm going to have to look up what it is, man, and and share it here with you all. But if I was coming back to the States right now and I had, you know, a reasonable about amount of money to get me a new vehicle right now, it would be uh, 2000 and whatever year. You know what I'm saying? Let's say I move back next year. It'd be a 2019 Chevy Equinox. Um, probably LT. I don't necessarily want to go with LTZ. I did see one that was a diesel. So I like that. Man, that's weird. I like that one. 
I like the diesel, but diesel works better over here in Europe. It does. It's, it's uh, like, I don't know. I just, it seems like, if I'm not mistaken, it's cheaper over here to have a diesel vehicle. But, um, there was one I saw that had diesel blue, you know, like a nice royal blue. Uh, gotta have my Bluetooth features with the new Chevy Android, um, auto features that they have uh i'm simple man i'm simple i don't need too much i don't need too much i don't need it to go too fast i'm not about to be out in these streets racing you know just give me a little something that i can you know be comfortable in listen to some good music this equinox right here has a pioneer sound system and it, it, it gets pretty good it gets pretty loud jams in here um, I wish that's something I wish I would have had on mine. I didn't have no super sound system in my Equinox when I had it. Um, so yeah, man, I just want to do something different. What, what do you all think, man? What's what's your favorite type of vehicle? Leave that in the comments. If you could just go, if you had any kind of money, you know what I mean, and you just you know a reasonable amount. Let's not let's let's say both something reasonable that you could get with your money right now. And then something that money's not an option. I'm balling. I'm going to go get this. To me, you know what? Let me add one in. It's going to be the Tesla. And then it was a Cadillac CTS. Whew. I've always liked those, man. I don't know why. I just always like those. So Tesla Model S, Cadillac CTS. And I'm talking with the fix it. It works. And then... Uh, whatever that Audi Kevin Durant had, but on a reasonable level, Chevy Equinox for me, with you know, nice LT model, uh, fixed all the way up. I think I can get one of them if I remember from my research. I can get one to be thirty four thousand to my liking. So that's not bad. That's not a bad price, man. But leave your thoughts in the comments, man. Thank you all for watching. Thank you all for sticking with me. Um, I truly appreciate it, man. More content is on the way. Still working on the album. For those of you who saw that video before, I'm working on the album. Hopefully, I can get that done soon. I'm going to do more videos when I hit the studio so that you can see the progress of the album coming. And, of course, more sneaker videos are coming soon. Thank you all for watching again, and I'll holler at you all in the next video. Peace.